Let me ask you about the president himself. You've described scars that you have from the president or his anger based on briefings you've given him. But what has the public heard from the president? It's been nearly three weeks since the president has commented on this publicly. And I want to take that period of time, almost three weeks, nothing from the president publicly. Where's the president the been? President, the president has been uh, an active voice for uh, increased resources in and reform at the Veterans Administration since he joined the Veterans Committee in the Senate over uh, seven, eight, nine years ago. But and I'm talking about a specific issue. And he will continue to go out and he will continue to talk as he did in Asia in response to questions. Uh, and uh, throughout the course of uh, his administration, uh, will continue to fight for reform, continue to fight for performance, and will put his money, the money of the, of the United States government where his mouth is. So if the veteran in the country says, where's the president been, you would say he's been playing the inside game. I would tell that I, that veteran would know that the president has been fighting for increased resources for the Veterans Administration. The president has been out time and again uh, fighting to make sure that not only those resources out there, but that the country recognizes the sacrifices that those veterans have made. The president is continually out there talking about the challenges that are faced in this country by veteran suicide. But he, by, has, uh, but he has not addressed this suicide. issue. Un untrue. I mean, in, in, as it, it in relates the fire to post traumatic going stress, on right as, now. as it relates to post traumatic stress, where he's been out there time and again, we have worked to lower veterans' unemployment by 1.5% uh, over the course of the last several years. And we'll continue to make sure that there's the kind of jobs available for vets. Dennis, he has fought for that. He will continue to Dennis, can you understand how a veteran who may have been victimized by these waiting lists or be concerned that they might soon become victimized by this waiting list, might hear all your answers and say, yes, I understand the broad argument you're making about things the president has done, but I need specific answers and specific outrage about this problem now. The president, nobody is more outraged about this problem right now, Major, than the president of the United States. And he will continue to press as it relates to this question of timely access to care until it is fixed. That's why we've invested uh, additional billions of dollars in the Veterans Health Administration so that they can have timely access to good care. And as it relates to these allegations, what we're going to do is we're going to get to the bottom of them, ensure we understand exactly what happened, and ensure that it never happens again.